The otters live by the rocky shore and their bodies make it easy to move in and out of the water. The fox, Fink, lives in the meadow hunting other animals to eat and laughs at Roz when she offers to find him berries since she doesn't know how to hunt. In chapter 21, The Introduction, Roz has been doing her best to observe the other animals and even learn their language to better survive. Unlike Roz, the animals have bodies, diets, and instincts that make it easy for them to live on the island. This is because the island is the animal's natural habitat and it isn't Roz's natural habitat. A habitat is a place that has the necessary food, water, and shelter that allows an animal to live and reproduce. For today's activity, you will be making your own habitat for the animals provided in your kit. Before creating habitat, fill out the animal habitat worksheet by researching one of the animals online or visiting the library and checking out a book. Once you've done that, you can make them a habitat. Try to include where they might sleep, what they might eat, or a place they'd hide. Cut the lid off your box. Glue the light blue piece of cardstock to the bottom of your box. This is the sky. Using the brown and green paint and paintbrushes from the camouflage activity, paint bushes, trees, and grass on the inside of the box. Let completely dry. Make a scene for the animals included in your box that shows where they may sleep, eat, or hide. You can also go outside if you want to include more rocks, grass, or sticks for your animals. Glue down your scene once you have it arranged using the glue included in your kit. If you have a hot glue gun at home, that might work best. Let the glue dry completely before moving your box.